coming at you from Soap Opera Spy, your number one source for daytime soap spoilers, updates, and more. Hi, General Hospital fans. It's Anne-Marie from Soap Opera Spy with all your hot soap news, spoilers, updates, and more. Now, before we get started with your General Hospital spoilers, if you're new to the site, kindly press that subscribe button and please turn on notifications to make sure you never miss a video from us. Hey, GH fans, today we're going to talk about your next two week spoilers. So everything that's going to go down in Port Charles from November 11th to November 22nd, where we're going to see Drew's electoral fate, Jason shuts out Carly, Sam's autopsy twist, Rick's client, and a whole lot more. So let's hop right into those spoilers so I can reveal how it's all going to go down. General hospital spoilers for the next two weeks, that would be November 11th to November 22nd, reveal that Drew Quartermain will pay Willow Corinthos a visit to check up on her following their hookup. Willow won't think it's wise to keep having private meetings like this, but Drew may insist he had to see if she was okay. Meanwhile, fans will see Christina Corinthos Davis cry for help during the week of November 11th to November 15th. Natalia Ramirez will apparently find Christina in distress as she deals with more grief over her sister Sam McCall's death. So it seems she'll get Sunny Corinthos on the phone. Natalia will show remorse later, so she may feel bad for judging Christina too harshly when they first met. Now that Natalia is starting to see some other sides of Christina, she may wish she'd been supportive of her relationship with Blaze, a.k.a. Alice and Ally Rogers. Over with Robert Scorpio, he'll contemplate his complex feelings for Holly Sutton, and open up to a disproving Max Scorpio. As for Holly, she'll make more demands in Jack Brennan's office before returning to Anna Devane with a request. Sasha Gilmore Corbin will also have a lot to mull over now that Holly has been selfless for once in her life. Felicia Scorpio will encourage Sasha to embrace this opportunity to bond with her mom Holly and get to know her dad Robert better too. Other general hospital spoilers say Lucky Spencer and Laura Collins will get some updates regarding Lulu Spencer's condition. Now that Lulu is recovering from her liver transplant, how will her numbers look? Could test results ultimately point to Lulu inching toward a coma awakening? General Hospital fans will see Trina Robinson make a powerful impression during a first meeting. There's a good chance that it'll involve a meet-cute with Kai, since he's set to make his first appearance soon. Elsewhere, Elizabeth Baldwin will give Jason Morgan a pep talk and perhaps offer a little reassurance about his newfound single dad status. However, Alexis Davis wants Danny Morgan and Scout Quartermain to live with her, so we'll see if Jason or Danny have any objections. There could be trouble if Danny is adamant about living with his dad, Jason, instead. Whatever the case, Jason will let his anger erupt on someone soon enough. We'll see if Alexis causes Jason to lose his temper, or if it could be someone like Brennan or Anna. Back with Drew, his electoral fate will be revealed. Will Drew achieve victory or face defeat once the results come in? Maxie Jones will also launch a confrontation with Nina Reeves. So she may echo Ava Jerome's warning about putting her relationship with Willow above all else. Nina may want nothing to do with Drew anyway once she finds out he slept with Willow and put her marriage even more at risk. But who knows with Nina? Across town, Michael Corinthos will tell Sonny about some problems in his marriage. But will he go into all the details? Regardless, Sonny may point out that without trust, it's going to be tough to make any relationship survive. Later, 
Willow and Michael will have a deep one-on-one -on -one conversation. Will there be any confessions about the cheating that's gone down on both sides? Michael knows Willow hooked up with Drew since he saw the footage for himself. So we'll see if he admits that or not. Of course, Michael also slept with Sasha. So he's not some innocent victim in all of this. No matter what Willow and Michael divulge, they'll have to figure out if there's truly a path forward for them as a couple. On another note, Rick Lansing will accept a new client, but he won't forget about Ava's case and doing what needs to be done. Isaiah Gannon will also have a significant offer, so it sounds like Portia Robinson will want him to become a full-time surgeon at General Hospital. At Jason's place, he'll face questions from Carly Spencer. Carly may not feel as close to Jason since he's been hiding things lately, but he'll continue to put his walls up and shut her out. Back with Anna, she'll have an honest discussion with Felicia. That could involve Anna's feelings for Jason and a mission that she's struggling to leave their kiss in the past. At some point, Sam's autopsy results will have to be revealed. That report could certainly stir up a lot of drama during the week of November 18th to November 22nd. Portia has been worried about the possibility of a Lucas error, but will the report point to something more sinister instead? If there are signs of foul play, this could become a police investigation. It's possible Cyrus Renault wiped Sam off the map intentionally by messing with her IV bag since there have been rumblings about that outcome. It's also possible someone else targeted Sam, but questions will linger no matter what. Finally, Sam's funeral is sure to be a tough day for all the loved ones she left behind, but they'll get through it as best as they can. Our predictions point to things getting worse before they get better from some mourning poor Charles residents, so stay tuned. General Hospital spoilers say the next two weeks will bring some gripping moments, so don't miss all the action. What do you think, General Hospital fans? What are you looking forward to seeing most the week of November 11th to November 22nd? How do you think General Hospital is going to handle Sam's autopsy? Is it going to be that she passes away from natural causes or is it going to be something more nefarious? Is Cyrus Renault going to be involved? Hit those comments and let us discuss your thoughts. And meanwhile, stick with us for all the up-to-date sizzling General Hospital spoilers, news, and more. And if you're new to the site, make us your top General Hospital source by pressing that subscribe button, turn on notifications, and if you like our video, Give us a like by pressing the like button. See you next time.